What's up guys, this is Merc Music, and today I'm gonna to be playing some COD World War II while talking about Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, because apparently it's not going to have multiplayer. <laughs> Exactly, what the fuck? Oh, we got Fook Tower, Flapjack Tower, Pancakes. So as the story usually goes, Charlotte Intel twattered out something pretty important about Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, telling us that sources are saying that there's not going to be multiplayer for Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. Multiplayer is really not that important for video games. No one really cares about multiplayer. It's everything to Modern Warfare 2. What are they thinking? MW2's multiplayer was amazing. I had over 60 days played. I was absolutely addicted to going for nukes. Had a lot of fun messing around and searching the street with my friends. And I know I just talked about this recently. I had a lot of like hackers and stuff. In general, it was a very broken Call of Duty game. But it was fun and that's all that really matters at the end of the day. Sure, it was casual as fuck. Oh, wait, hold on, feed. Definitely a feed here. Give me the feed. Spawn him here. They didn't, they didn't fucking do it. But yeah, it was the most casual, laid back, and fun Call of Duty game. Bar none. The fact that it was so broken and had so many problems and shit, it's really what made it such a fun game. Everything was over the top. You had shotgun secondaries that were extremely powerful. They had just introduced customizable kill streaks, pro perks. A lot of people would take, uh, oh god, there's a nope. Thing. How is that not a quad feed? But yeah, I feel like a lot of people just kind of take this stuff for granted or forget the history of all this. But looking back, it seems like every single aspect of Modern Warfare 2, they pretty much just took Call of Duty 4 and they cranked everything up to 11. Ah! Okay, well, that's what happens when you. What the f- I don't even know. I can't explain that. But basically what I'm getting at here is that if you just have this remastered game with just a campaign, it's not gonna go over very well. The response I've seen on Twitter is already just disgusting. Like, obviously no one's up for this. Modern Warfare 2 without its multiplayer? That's like selling someone a car without wheels. <laughs> the fuck are you doing? On top of that, Charlie Until also said that Raven is not actually developing this. At least from what their sources are saying so far. Which would make sense, because Raven knows what they're doing. Oh! And that's not to just completely shit on whoever might be making this remaster. It's just like, whoever is making this remaster, if you don't have multiplayer, just why? We need an explanation. One thing that is interesting is that this does confirm that we are going to be getting MW. W2 remastered. If I'm not mistaken, when Modern Warfare Remastered was first talked about, they didn't say anything about multiplayer. Maybe the early sources don't know if there's multiplayer yet? There is a chance that that's the case. If they didn't have details to reveal about multiplayer, they can't really talk about it, so. All I'm saying is that if we don't have multiplayer, then we don't have Modern Warfare 2. The same thing goes for any Call of Duty game. If you take out its multiplayer, you're really taking away the part of the game that people play the most. You know, the important thing that people actually want to play. I saw some tweets and they summed it up pretty well. You'd be paying $25 to play a campaign that you've already played for like four hours or so, so yeah. Not really a good offering, not a good move. I'm not gonna spawn here. Oh, okay, that is so mine. Gimme, gimme, gimme. What the fuck? God damn it. But yeah, if this whole Modern Warfare 2 remastered, like, no multiplayer thing is real, it is very disappointing. It just seems like, in general, Call of Duty is, like, lacking direction and focus. I think as far as it goes for a Call of Duty game, we just need one solid game that actually, like, really appeals to fans. It needs free regular updates like Fortnite does, because Fortnite is killing it. The game has clearly taken a lot of Call of Duty fans and a lot of the COD community, and it's moved it. Because the game is free and it's so easy to get access to, and they keep giving free updates to do new things, Call of Duty needs to take notes from that and learn from that and adapt. At this point, you can't be remastering old games and not have the multiplayer and expect that to go over well. Just, it, it's just, oh boy. It's got me fucking heated. I feel like the room's spinning. Like, seriously, who who makes these decisions? It's really, it, it's legitimately infuriating. Especially because games like Call of Duty 4, World of War, Modern Warfare 2, they're so nostalgic to me. Fuck's sake. I need some air. I feel like I want to make valid points and now I'm just at the point where I'm just want to be like, fuck! It's just got me so heated, I'm so mad. But who knows, man? I'm, I like, I still want to have that little bit of hope and faith. I want to believe that no one would really make that decision and that the game will actually have a multiplayer. But again, we'll just have to wait and see. But I guess there is one silver lining to this whole thing. It's that we're getting Black Ops 4. At this point in time, Black Ops 4 is officially confirmed so we can look forward to that. Oh my, god. oh my god, wow, that is sad for you. I'm going, possibly. Oh, they're all the way back there and the thing does not have the range. This is the Orso, by the way. It's a pretty neat SMG. I've been trying to hit a feed with it. So here's pretty much my final thoughts. If we're still going to be remastering Call of Duty games, do it right. We need the full game, the full experience at a reasonable price with the DLC maps for free. Fingers crossed that Black Ops 4 is a standout game because all of the Black Ops games have been really good. Is that a team? That's a fucking teammate camping there. Wow, why am I surprised? All most people do now on this game is just camp with LMGs and hardcore, so... And again, I've said it so many times, I still think that this is the way to go with Call of Duty. We really just need a game like Call of Duty Online to come to the rest of the world. A free-to-play, uh, oh god. Wow, nice team kill. Camping fu A free-to-play Call of Duty game that's constantly updated with really awesome content. As a matter of fact, that's exactly what Fortnite's doing, so... Yeah, just do what Fortnite does, because I mean, fuck, I want Drake to fucking play with me, dude. Why am I getting team killed so much, you fucks? Don't, it's a teammate grenade. Yep, thank you, buddy. His name is Fubar, which means fuck the field all reason. At least your grenade throw was. <laughs> XD fucking. He left the game. Yeah, you know what you did. Get the fuck out of this lobby. You are so fucked, dude. If you're curious, this guy's just camping, watching B with an LMG. That's right. Wake up. Do it. Do it. Do it. Get your third team kill. Get your fucking third team kill, buddy. Fuck. Hey, buddy. I don't care anymore. I, I stopped caring. Bye. Yeah, come here, buddy. You yeah, do it. Get your third one. What? <laughs> There's an enemy there? Oh, shit. Do it. Do it. Fucking do it. Never mind. <laughs> do it. You first. Do it. <laughs> what was that face, dude? Do it. Fucking do it. You won't. You fucking won't. I'll do it. I'm gone. But anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video about me talking about Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. If you guys did and you would like to see Modern Warfare 2 Remastered have a multiplayer, make sure to drop a like, and I'll see you guys later.